Hi everyone, we went to the small picturesque town of Us, located in the heart of the beautiful Monmouthshire countryside. Here in South Wales, the streets of Us are steeped in history with many charming old buildings and a wonderful Norman castle. It has become known for its floral displays and history of success in Britain in Bloom competition, winning the Wales in Bloom competition for 35 times in a row between 1982 and 2016. So it's richly deserving of the title Town of Flowers. This town sits on one of the finest salmon fishing rivers in the country, the River Us. The river is 137 kilometers. It's the longest river to flow wholly within Wales. I always love taking pictures of the flowers or plants and mostly wildlife, while Zach enjoyed playing in the play area by the river. It was so quiet, especially the weather was not good. But come summer, it will be packed with people swimming and having picnics. I was also learning to skip stones. The objective of skipping is to <coughs> see how many times a stone can bounce before it sinks into the water. Thin flat stones work Dancing best. How are you doing it? Yeah, I'm starting to get Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, very good. I was happy to be able to bounce the stone twice. Not bad for a learner like me. Lastly, we went to the Usk Castle. It's the ruins of a wonderful Norman castle standing on a hill overlooking the town with the views down the Usk. This is a little known fact. While Germany may have the most amount of castles, Wales has more castles per square mile than any other country in Europe. Despite its small size, Wales has over 600 castles. So that it's here in the age of 46 in the past, we didn't, didn't that last, live so long that he was Richard Strongbow to care was, he was only 46 when he passed. Did we sit there so early? So Maybe.